Hey Linda, that was great. Now, we've learned how to solve that problem. When we're hitting the ball in the net, remember we've got to get a foot below to clear the net. Okay, now the other bigger, biggest problem we have in tennis is we're hitting the ball long. How do we prevent that? Um, what I suggest, when you're in your ready position, when you're facing the net, now your grip is pretty good as it is, your backhand grip. And notice, see how the racket face is closed here a little bit? Mm -hmm. All right, that's what you want in your ready position. Keep the racket face closed like that. Now, as you bring the racket back, your backswing, what you do from this position here, go ahead, turn to here, is probably the most important part of your swing. If you keep the racket face slightly closed like that, now if you drop it down, step out a little bit as you go down, good. Now swing forward. See, you're guaranteed vertical here. Mm -hmm. You're not going to be open. Okay. But remember, now, okay, come back to your ready position. See, you start out with it in this position, right? Okay, now go ahead, turn, keep it closed. All right, look at your racket. Still slightly closed, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now you're guaranteed vertical at contact. If you come down, this is a foot below the contact point and swing up. Now, if you're hitting long, when you get to this point here, where's the palm of your left hand facing right now? Down. Down, okay, so remember those two words, palm down. If your palm is down, that's going to prevent the ball from sailing long, okay? And also that backswing from the ready position. All right, so let's work on your backswing. I want you to think of a couple of things. Let's think about keeping the face closed, face closed, and palm down. Okay. Okay? All right, here we go. <clears throat> We're thinking face closed and palm down. Okay, so close up the face a little bit. Good. And palm down. Okay, good. Face closed and palm down. All right, now make sure you get a good foot below the ball. That's beautiful. That was real good. You had the face closed and you got a good foot below the ball. Good shot. All right, you didn't get under that one. Remember now, we got to go back to the first thing we were, we were working on. All right, remember if the ball goes in the net, what do you need to do? How low do you have to get the racket? A foot below. Okay, so remember you're going to... Bend the knees like you're sitting down on a chair. Your rear end goes down. Right. So now we change the two things that we were thinking about. Let's think about, um, I want you to think, I want you to be specific. So let's think about a foot below. Okay. Say that to yourself. Okay, a ready? A foot below. Okay, good. See, you're clearing the net right away. Very good. Two in a row. Give me four. Three, one more. All right, four in a row. Now, now we want to prevent the ball from going long. What do we think about? Do you remember? The palm down. Palm down is one. And the face. And the face closed, closed is two, right? But which happens first? The face closed or the palm down? Face closed. Okay, so that's, see, always think of them in the sequence that they're happening. Okay. Okay, so think face closed and then think palm down. Ready? Beautiful, that's the idea. I'm sorry. Good get, Linda. That's it. You got it. Go up. Good shot. Okay, off the back foot. That was good. I like that because you were leaning back and you realized, hey, I better hit it high and hard. Right. And that's what you want to do when you have to go back like that. Here we go. Okay, great. Face closed, palm down. Good shot. Notice at this point, the racket face is closed and the palm of the left hand is facing down. Remember, this prevents shots beyond the baseline. Notice the shoulder touches the chin on the finish. Great hitting, Linda. That's fantastic. Good job. Thanks. So remember now, you can solve the two biggest problems in tennis. You're either hitting in the net or you're hitting long. All right, I'm going to ask you now. Pressure's on, Linda. <laughs> <laughs> if you're hitting in the net, what do you need to do? If you're hitting into the net... <clears throat> remember, how low do you have to get the racket? Uh, foot below. That's it. So you've got to bend more. Remember, think of sitting down on that chair. Right. Okay? Now, if you're hitting long, what have you got to do? You have to uh, racket close, palm down. Right. Face closed, palm down. Very good. Remember those points, and I'm telling you, you're going to get more and more consistent. You won't miss a ball anymore. Okay, good. <laughs> <All right. laughs> okay, very good.